Alrighty, you can't come to Florida Daytona Bike Week and drive by a Bucky's without stopping. I brought the Advan Black team to experience it for the very first time. Let's go see what we can eat. They've got every gift in the world that you can imagine, every knickknack, every, look at the sequence on that sucker. We need one of those. All right, let's go get our food. You got world famous beef jerky, you got burritos, tacos, you've got anything you can come, brisket. Can you, you recommend something for me? I like the chopped brisket myself. That's yeah, my favorite that's sandwich, right chopped brisket. And you can shower while you make for your food. And Jessica's gonna get a shower. <laughs> All right, team, what do you got for us? Dwayne, how long have you been working here? What's your favorite thing to cook? Sausage on a stick. So someone's got to try sausage on a stick. I'm sticking, I'm sticking with chopped brisket. Can I try one? a beaver chip. Beaver chips at Bucky's. I'm gonna try the three meats. All right, three meat. Have you had it before? I have not. I've only had the chopped brisket. That's all I get ever get. All right, we're checking out at Bucky's now. Sonia is doing a great job of putting everything in our bag. Sonia is so happy to be on camera right now. <laughs> Bucky's! I'm Eddie here from Advan Black. We're here at Daytona Bike Week 2024. Looks like we got some type of install going on right here, right now. Hey, what you got going on, man? Hey, I'm Ty from Advan Black, and guess what? We're installing an attack headlight on a customer's road glide. CBO, we just brought it in. It's gonna take about 20 minutes. We're gonna get this knocked out and get him back on the road. Hey, that's awesome. I can't wait to see it on this uh, beautiful CBO. Hey guys, I have Burke here from Beggars and Brews. That's right, yeah, baby. So he has his bike here at our booth in Daytona Bike Week 2024. Yeah. And Bert, tell us a little bit about your bike. So this is this is the Gold Digger. So I just got this last year, the end of last year, after a mishap with the last bike, which we had almost completely done with all your parts. So we're just getting restarted on this one. But I have the uh, the front fender, the hugger fender. Obviously the hand guards. I have the Vengeance floorboards, but I kind of have a twist on them. I took them to powder coat and had them done red to match kind of the accents that I'm doing on this. Um, so you can't get them red like that from Advan Black, but you can get them from Ad Black, Advan Black and have them done that way yourself. Um, I also have the tour pack from Advan Black, the King tour pack, along with the uh, the, the backrest and I have the seat but I have the seat off right now because the wife hates that back seat so <laughs> I love the seat myself yeah, whatever the front seat is great but the back seat is killer so gotta make the gotta make the wife happy right yeah definitely I took so we took that off swapped that out just for today I have the seat back at the uh, at the campground okay. um, what else did I do I have the I have the rear fender I just haven't installed it yet okay. um, so that'll right. go on real soon and um, I have the attack headlight that has to go in. I just haven't had a chance to do that yet. So I have a lot of the Advan Black. Pop this is a very unique color, and it you is. don't see this color a lot, you know, in the in the parking lot. You do or so, you don't? No, I don't. No, I, I, don't I don't either. I definitely don't. So, um, so these one of the are reasons all... I liked it. Not only did I like the color, but it, I knew I hadn't seen a lot of them out in the wild. So yeah. I figured yeah. it would kind of stand out. It's once a very I, unique color. Once I did some stuff it's to it, it's not very easy to match. I can tell you that. No. But all of the parts that come uh, color match painted already. Yeah. Right. So. You talk about all these parts and your bike and what you're gonna do with it mm -hmm. in your channel. Yeah, absolutely. We we talk about my bike and George's bike. He also has a Road Glide, and he has uh, several of the Advan products as well, Advan Black. Uh, but we talk about that. We do a lot of rally stuff like this. I've been walking around getting footage here. Um, we do a lot of ride videos. That's kind of how our channel started, where we would ride to breweries because Baggers and Brews, we like beer, craft beer. 
So we, we ride to a lot of uh, uh, craft breweries and stuff like that. That's kind of how the channel started. Right. And then it's just kind of grown into more. And I think you guys do like uh, charity events from time to yes, time. Yes, we, we have a big charity event coming up in July. We're doing the Baggers and Brews Poker Run and Veteran Support Rally where we live in South Jersey. Uh, if you want to come out to that, there's plenty of information on that on our Instagram and our YouTube page, so check that out. Or just send us an email at baggersandbrews at gmail.com and we'll let you know about it. But and I've, huge event. I've been in your live section one you time, You have been right? on our live stream, And yeah. you guys do it regularly? And we, we, about... do, we try to do it regularly. We've, we've uh, we slowed down a little bit in the winter, but we're going we're gonna to pick back up. But yeah, we try to do at least one, one a month. Live streams are fun. And they're just to kind of connect with the audience, you know, the viewers and stuff. And right. Hang out. It's a lot of fun. I've been there, yeah. I've been there one time. And yeah, it's a lot, it is fun. A lot, a lot of fun. It is fun. So uh, lastly, what else are you planning to do with your bike? So, um, like I said, I have a few parts I've already gotten. The, the rear fender and the headlight, those are going to go in. I have a ton of lighting from Ciro that are going to go on okay. here. Okay. Um, and then I'm hoping to get the, uh, the fang lower fairing. Okay, yeah, the, uh, the CVO style one. The spoiler. CVO style one, yeah. 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 Put that on. And then I just have a few other red accents, and that's kind of going to be it for now until okay, something cool. else cool comes out, I guess. You know, maybe like a, you know. Yeah, I'll, I'll look front, forward to see how, how it comes out, you know, after everything is done. Cool. Yeah, definitely. So, guys, check out Beggar and Bruce's channel if you have never yeah. seen the channel. Like, follow, and subscribe, and check out the uh, Bert's contents with George. Hey, I'm here with Chris, another fellow Ohioan, which is awesome to always meet somebody. We're down here at Daytona Bike Week. Chris has got this amazing bike. He's got a big rig to match, so I want him to tell us a little bit about Tell us about your bike first. Well, the bike's a 22 Street Glide. It's got the full Advan Black uh, Ravenger Series paint job on it. Nothing untouched. It's got Moonshine Horsepower 128 kit build done to it. Um, of course, the color matched my, my Harley. It goes with me all across the country. Got to have it everywhere I go. All right. I mean, so what more we need. Now, what do you do? What do you, you drive something big, right? Like yeah, I drive an 18-wheeler all across the country. I'm in aviation. I haul jet engines. Um, we stay out two, three months at a time and just serving the aviation community. It's all I do. If it don't go on an airplane, we don't haul it. Wonderful. Now, so. tell me about your 18-wheeler. What color is it? It's green. It's a little, little different shade of green than this radioactive green, but it's uh, everything matches. It's, it's green. My trailer's green. Can you describe to me how you take this motorcycle with you? Well, I've got a motorcycle box, a custom box I had built for the back of my truck. Um, it has a Neodyne motorcycle lift on it. I'm able to load it up, strap it down, and take it with me wherever I go. Chris, you know? that is awesome. You've got a bike, a rig to match. It's always with you. It never leaves you. Do you know what the horsepower rating is on this 128 uh, Moonshine? It, it dynoed at 145 horsepower, 148 torque. Beautiful. Yeah. So you're so, moving around Daytona pretty quickly. Yeah. I mean, it, I can't describe the power that this bike has. I mean, from from stock factory, I mean, it just come unleashed. I mean, it's, it's the best thing ever. It woke it up. It, it woke it up. <laughs> That is amazing. Yes, well, good, man. We're so glad that you're here. You're at the Advan booth here at Daytona Bike Week showing off your full bundle kit. Even the seat. Oh, my God. I just noticed you had the seat, too. I got the Advan Black seat. I mean, everything on here is Advan Black. Inner, outer fairings, everything. I've got a full Rockford Fosgate stereo system on here with the subwoofers. Um, of course, I've got the Thunder Max High Ride suspension as well. I still need to, I want to lower the front suspension. Got the 21-inch wheel on it. Um, yeah. Oh, you don't I mean, have our 21-inch wheel, though. No, you guys didn't have them at the time. All right. But now, you know, <laughs> maybe, maybe. We'll get a color match front <laughs> wheel to go on it, maybe. I love it. Yes, sir. Awesome. Thanks so much, Chris. Thanks Not for problem. sharing your story. Thanks for allowing us to be part of your life. Well, I appreciate it. I'm a fan. Hey guys, this is Alan with Monkey today at Daytona Bike Week 2024 at the Abandoned Booth in Speedway. Yeah, at the Speedway this year, it's a lot of fun. We got all the major manufacturers around us, a lot of aftermarket stuff, a lot of neat stuff. None of it is cool as Advent Black, of course. But uh, stop by and check us out, see all the stuff. Order yourself a tour pack, you. stretch bags, all that sort of stuff. So, uh, talk to Eddie, Mr. Eddie. LEDs and bags himself. Yeah. And uh, Monkey, can you tell us like this is how many times you've been to Daytona before? I've been to Daytona only about a half dozen times. I go to Sturgis my whole life. Uh, I only live a few hours away, and it's gotten really big, really, really popular. Everybody's here. Fantastic bike shows. The nightlife is the best, of course. You see all your friends. Daytona's a lot of fun. Awesome, awesome. So can you tell us you know, when's the best time to uh, hit the Main Street? 
Oh gosh, it's so packed up. I mean, you can be there till two or three in the morning every night. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I would say, of course, your Friday and Saturday nights, both weekends are huge. The second weekend is really, really, really big. Yeah. Get ready to not be able to move when you walk down the sidewalk, but you're going to have a good time. Definitely. So a lot of uh, our audience is already your subscribers on your YouTube channel. So <laughs> I'm pretty sure they've been following you for quite some time and they know what you're doing with the bikes, right? What bikes are you uh, bringing today or to this event? I've got my uh, skinny chopper. I've got my 19 CVO that's decked out in the Advan Black Pyro body in red. Uh, and I've got my wife's uh, Springer Crossbones. Okay, cool. uh, I would be on the chopper here today, but it broke. So I'm on the, <laughs> it electrocuted me going down the road oh and I had God. to take it back to the campground. So I'm on the Springer today. Right. And then, but I've been on my, uh, my CVO most of the time. If you haven't subscribed to his channels, please do. He talks a lot about, you know, bikes and choppers and <laughs> a lot of crazy things that he does in his garage. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you for, for being here, Monkey. Thanks, buddy. Top Gun, this is a shooting range, they've got guns, but you know what they have outside? Drift Cross. You gotta check this out. Full throttle, wide open, on the gas, boom, on the brake, let it rip, come on, get through the exit, boom! but not to do this. Come on, <laughs> let's do this. I probably have the legs for it though. I can reach the ground a lot faster. <laughs> All right, final turn. Ah. Man, what I love about this is it's not just old clapped out bikes. There's some really nice bikes, whether it's a soft tail or it's a bagger. We got one bagger that I've seen entered so far. These guys are killing it. All different ages. This kid is my favorite. Just sing the national anthem. We've got Drifter Cross kicking off. Number 666 is gonna drop it first. Let's see what he can do. All right. All right, he enters the first cone. Comes out hot. All right, now he's gonna position himself for the ramp. Lands. Perfect. Lay it around, lay it around, lay it around. Full crowd, full crowd, come on. One full. All 
All right, Ty with Avan Black. We are at Volusia Top Gun once again here at the Drift Cross, and I just ran into another cool guy because his name's Tyler. Tyler with Lexan. Tyler, tell us about why are you here? What do you guys do? We're out here supporting Drifter Cross. These are our neighbors in Costa Mesa. So we're just out here hooking all the, the racers up with tire pumps, but we also got t-shirts. We got some of our new novices for sale. So yeah, we're just out here supporting the community that supports us. So what's a novice? Tell us about this. So this is our new Bluetooth intercom system. This one's cool because it has the mesh. So it's a one touch connect. So yeah, you can talk to another rider. You can make phone calls, listen to music, GPS, all that stuff. So I'm thinking with Drifter Cross, right? We got to let some air out of our tires to get some good traction, yep. get them good spin. This is perfect to have in the bag, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. So I keep them in my work trucks. Buddy's got them in rock crawlers, side by sides. I air up my kids' quads and all that stuff. So yeah, it's perfect for anything that has a tire and air. So give me a little spec on it. What 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 kind of PSI can we get up to? Uh, you can go up to 150 PSI. Um, there's different modes, so you can switch from like balls, tires, all that stuff. But um, it also has a built-in battery bank, so you could charge your phones, anything like that from it too. Built-in flashlights, so if you're airing up in the dark, you can actually see what you're doing. Are we allowed to talk about prices here? Yeah. So these are uh, $69.95 on the website. That's it? Yep, that's it. What about today? Show special? Uh, we got show, show special. Sp where we got 40 bucks, and we're throwing in the extended hose kit, which is normally 20 bucks. Right on. Now what about these, the novices? Um, these are regularly $4.79 for a dual pack. At the show, we got them for $3.50. Man, those are some great show prices. Yeah. Are they flying off the shelf? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we got uh, just a handful left. Support the local riders, drift across, and come see us. If not, visit our website, lexin-moto.com. Awesome. So we are here in Florida, right? Yeah. And say again where you're from. Uh, we're from Costa Mesa, California. So you so, came, we're, we're neighbors, so yeah. you, you came all the way here to support this. Oh, yeah, yeah. We made the trip out, so we all fly home tomorrow. So we're here for this, for the people. Awesome. Thanks so much, Tyler. Yeah. All right. So my name's Jackie. I have been riding for probably like seven years now. Uh, my husband bought me my first bike and he got me a little like 250 and I learned to ride on that. Uh, honestly, I've ridden like everything in between. I rode like a 636 for a while. I had my first uh, 883 like years ago. Got another one and we built it. I wanted to learn how to like drift and like wheelie. So I've learned to wheelie on like a Grom. Uh, and so then I wanted something bigger and better than the 883. Um, so we went and bought this brand new and here we are. I sent the tins out to uh, Tim out in Florida and he did the, can you, do you think he can hear me? Yeah, this is pretty good. Okay, uh, so he did like the custom paint. I chose, I, I actually gave him like complete freedom because I didn't know what I wanted. He's like, what colors do you want? I'm like, I don't know. He's like, well, what design do you want? I'm like, I don't know. So um, I was like, do your thing. I like pink, purple, I like girly colors. Uh, and he literally like created this. Um, I've had some really cool companies work with me. La Para, Sawicki did my exhaust. Uh, Clockworks did my windscreen. Shred Hills, Vulgar, I mean. You've got a great variety of parts. Yeah. So how, do we, how do we find oh, you? Oh, like, Fox Fab Moto did my crash bars. Okay, how do we find you on social media so that we can follow you and uh, yeah, be able to tag you? Yeah, Back Jack. So we, we created that name and I've gotten like so much shit for it because I can't wheelie really well. I can wheelie like a Grom and a KTM. Uh, but that was like my husband and some of my friends came up with it. They're like, you should be Drop Back Jack because it like goes so well. And my dream was to like wheelie. So that's my name, Drop Back Jack. So you're going to get there though. Yes. Uh, my dream really is to wheelie the 883. So I've like pulled it up a little bit, but it's like mm, awesome. scary. Well, so. thanks so much for sharing yeah, your passion, your bike with us. Yeah. Have a great week. You too. All right. Thank you. All right, Jessica, this is the last part of the vlog for the Advent Black YouTube channel. We are ending on an awesome and a fun way. What have you thought about Drifter Cross? Very exciting. It was so much fun. I can't wait for next year. Yes, I'm excited as well. This has been a great week. Been great as a team. We've got to meet lots of people. And We've got to meet so many people here. Lots of customers, lots of dealers, a lot of the vendors, made new friends. Yes, been super thankful for the weather that's allowed things like Drift Across to even happen and be, for us to be able to be set up in a booth with Eddie, who's selling. He's selling lots. Yes.
Awesome, yeah. So what we wanted to say is just thanks for watching us, thanks for following us, and we hope you continue to turn in to more of our YouTube videos. Ad Van Black, check our channel out.